good morning and a warm welcome to your students in the last grammar lesson we have learnt was and were today in grammar we are going to learn a new topic that is how many and how much are you ready for that subject grammar how many and how much the name of the lesson is how many and how much we use how many to ask questions about things we can count now where we are going to use this how many so here we use how many to ask question okay we use this how many to ask questions about things we can count i have given you two examples how many two pencils five books five chocolates seven erasers etc so how many here you can count them 2 5 3 100 200 we can count next is how may i have given you another example how many flowers are there in the basket so you can count the flowers there 1 2 3 4 and you can answer that there are 10 flowers 20 flowers so once again we use how many to ask questions about things we can count next is how much how much we use how much to ask questions now how much also is used to ask questions and how many is also used to ask questions but here to ask question about things we cannot count the things that we are not able to count for such things we use how much we use how much for example how much oil you can't say one oil two oil three oil no so how much oil how much juice you can't say one juice two juice three juice so how much oil how much juice how much gas okay you can can't say one gas two gas three gas so how much gas now oil juice and gas we cannot count this even water kerosene all these things we cannot count so we use how much oil how much juice how much gas etc i have given you another example how much water is there in the jar okay you how much water is left or there in the jar so we use how much to ask questions about things we cannot count i hope you have understood where we use this words how many and how much how many to ask question about things we can count how much to ask questions about things we cannot count now based on this we are going to do a exercise question is fill in the blanks with how much or how many dash trees can you see the question is dash trees can you see now before you give me the answer let me ask you one question can you count the trees yes yes we can count the trees 5 7 8 9 so 
what we are going to use here how much or how many yes very good how many dash greenery can you see in the park now can you count the greenery one greenery two greenery three greenery no you cannot count greenery so here we write how much so how much greenery can you see in the park next next dash fun are the children having can you count the fun no you cannot count the fun so here how much fun are the children having dash tables are there in the room can you count the tables yes five tables seven tables 10 tables 20 tables yes we are not talking about multiplication tables we are talking about the wooden tables so we can count so the answer is how many next dash birds are sitting on the tree can you count the birds yes we can count the birds five birds seven birds 10 birds so we can count the birds so how many how many birds are sitting on the tree next dash rice is that in a sack can you count the rice one rice two rice three rice no we cannot count the rice so we use how much how much rice is there in a sack number 7 dash books are there in the cupboard can you count the books yes 55 45 25 we can count the books so the answer is how many books are there in the cupboard next dash water is there in the bottle can you count the water one water two water no we cannot count the water so here we write how much water is there in the bottle now children please remember at the end of the sentence you have to put question marks because all the sentence is asking questions take your grammar notebook take a new page write the name of the lesson and along with the definition and the exercise copy in your grammar notebook thank you children have a nice day